Each year at Canada's Farm Progress Show here in Regina, the grain augers and conveyors on display have more and more capacity. But this year is something brand new, the Bergen Double Barrel Grain Auger. You know, this is a, a very incredible auger. Obviously, it's a double barrel. It's a twin 16-inch diameter grain auger. This is 50 feet long. It's driven by two 60 horsepower electric drive engines uh, or motors and um, it is clearly set up to move a lot of grain. We rate this unit for 600 bushels a minute. So does it have special applications? Do you expect it's not the type of thing a typical producer, even large producers, would likely use at this point, is it? No, not your average farmer. That's obviously not what we were going for. Uh, there's a company called Mobile Grain, based just outside of Regina, that contacted us with a very specific need. And they needed high volume, and incredible durability. Now, obviously anything that uh, has moving parts at some point, something's gonna go out. It could just be something as simple as an electrical motor that fails well with this. They don't have to move anything. They just keep on running with one of the augers as they both run independent. Uh, the durability is incredible. So they're moving uh, grain into carts uh, for loading into rail cars, is that their? That's correct, yeah. They need to be able to unload semis in a hurry uh, by unloading into large grain carts. That gives them that opportunity. Then the grain carts simply take it away to the rail cars. So how many of these are they built? They, they, they have more than one of these that, that they, they're using? Yeah, this is the third unit that they've purchased from us. And uh, so far, they are very pleased with the results. Now, I hesitate to ask, but what's the approximate price tag? <laughs> yeah, that's a question everybody wants to know. The price for one of these, you can pull one away for 129000 So you're using three-phase power on it, is that right? That's correct, yeah, three-phase. And you just found that was uh, the best for the, the particular usage. Have you considered uh, other ways of powering it? Uh, just based on the particular application that these folks are using, uh, the three-phase power is clearly the way to go. Uh, better suited than tractor horsepower. Uh, the electrical horsepower is the way to go. It's interesting, I heard somebody come by and say, you know, this maybe is overkill, and they thought, well, you know, there's a there's that honeybee tractor over there that in 1979, <laughs> it looked like overkill too. Well, you know, and that's a story that Bergen Industries has heard for a long time. My dad built the first 10 and 3 quarter inch diameter grain auger back in 1952. And back then, oh, we heard an awful lot of that. Uh, we heard the same thing when we created the first heavy harrow back in 1982. That was overkill. Uh, what's overkill in the farming world? Boy, I'll tell you, it's only the imagination that'll take it there.